Welcome to another episode of Data Star. If you haven't already subscribed to our channel, do it now so that you never miss an update on a new episode. Let's jump into today's episode of Data Star. Welcome everyone to another episode of Data Star. Data Star is one of those series that I have loved doing the most because in this series I analyze one job of data science in a company that you would want to work with. and that's why i've loved doing every episode of this in this episode i'm going to analyze one job for you at one of the top notch companies that a lot of lot of people want to work with it is mastercard so the company that we have today is mastercard the role mastercard has posted is of a data scientist and this role is based out of gurgaon right so now let's First of all look at some of the key highlights of this role and let's see if this is the kind of role that you would want to apply for as well. So the first thing that is mentioned about this role is that it is an entry level position. So someone with say let's say 0 to 5 7 years of experience usually is considered an entry level role in the industry but it will it might depend depending on what exact experience uh, is the company wanting you to have so firstly let's read read a little bit about mastercard this is what the company has given here as all of you would know who are watching this video uh, mastercard is a global technology company and it is along with visa one of the uh, two most popular payment processing networks right so this is what mastercard essentially is and this is what uh, the vision uh, has been given in the section now in the second part the company has actually posted here a little more about the requirements starting with the job title which is data scientist and then the overview so in the overview what the jd says is the financial crime solution team builds products and services so this is the first thing that uh, what we know which team in mastercard is hiring for data science for this particular role it is the financial crime solutions team it builds products and services powered by payments data by combining data science techniques with an intimate knowledge of payments data we develop solutions that will improve outcomes for people businesses and economy so essentially what they want is that this we craft bespoke algorithm bespoke algorithm is on demand maybe not your regular algorithm but making a new algorithm all together to solve a problem that help our clients gain an understanding of the underlying criminal behavior that drive financial crime so fraud analytics fraud detection is one of the biggest uh, pain points for financial services companies and no matter how many great technologies you have in the world criminals which is especially cyber uh, criminals related to money always find new techniques and this is where data scientists and deep learning experts machine learning experts come into picture that they are always trying to find new solutions to the problem so this is what the team is financial crime solutions team and this is now what we have understood uh, is the requirement of the role so here what is what the jd has given is more description of the role as a data scientist you will join one of the first teams in the world looking at account to account payments data across the world so what essentially you would be doing is you would be looking at the different accounts maybe from which fraud has happened or and has been detected and within the prototype team you will help build systems that expose money laundering and detect frauds and scam as well as help mastercard and our clients understand the underlying behaviors employed by criminals so essentially what mastercard is focusing on is three things fraud fraud and fraud so everything that is to do with fraud detection fraud prevention uh, understanding the patterns and understanding the accounts etc to get insights this is what mastercard is interested in now the perfect candidate for this role ideally should be someone who has worked it has worked in fraud detection on fraud prevention from a machine learning data science or analytics point of view and ideally in a bfsi company but even if you have not worked in a bfsi company uh, frauds happen in all different industries as well let's say in retail as well right even if you have very good understanding of uh, fraud criminal uh, uh, behavior in other industries and you have used analytics and data science then i think it is of certainly great help now in terms of role what uh, the jd says is prof perform proof of concept projects so what 
the company is saying is that there are different kinds of frauds happening and we don't know whether all of the data science techniques that we'll be using will be successful. So proof of concept techniques we'd be using. Engage in production design, building prototypes and production models. So this is what is expected from a typical data science role. Use full range of data science and open source technologies and techniques to develop new services to aid financial and exist uh, uh, crime products. So what MasterCard is saying, they already have existing financial crime products. You will be improving upon that and leverage and enhance research done by other teams in doing financial crime patterns hidden in payment data. So essentially what they're doing saying is they, we, they already have other teams who are working on similar problems and basically you'll be building upon that knowledge, expertise and in-house knowledge to solve this problem. Apart from that, write white papers, patents and create client facing data visualization and demos, something which is required in a lot of data science or roles, right? In the end, it says th this means considering privacy, ethic uh, ethics and regulation as well as the performance of your code and accuracy of your models. You need to consider the full impact of your work because you are dealing in a highly regulated kind of environment. You should be able to understand the overall ecosystem also pretty well. Now, this is what the role is. So essentially a lot to do with the financial crime and expect that the interview will be a lot focused on that as well. Now, here's what the company has asked in terms of what they'd expect from you. So first of all, you enjoy building products to solve real pressing problems for, for uh, your clients. So basically you building products is something that should come you should enjoy that's the first requirement because you're building solutions here so that's very much expected the second thing you would uh, need to have is you enjoy working on a team and have an interest in data science and how advanced algorithms may be deployed as product offering so what here they're saying is that we are not only interested in machine learning algorithm but how they are deployed as well if you know this this is and icing on cake and I think that that you your chances of getting through the interview are really really good you are excited by new technologies and approaches and uh, to development and are keen to promote the use and in enterprise setting this is pretty standard you have four years of experience at least in Python and are familiar with standard data science libraries such as Py pandas scikit-learn, numpy, and tensorflow. So this is what the company says that you need to have minimum of this many years of experience. So what, although the position is entry level position, but what they're wanting is someone who can get started from day one. So this is, first of all, what you need to remember when the company says four plus years of experience, they are not necessarily looking for an expert, but someone who can get cracking from day one so that you should be that kind of uh, candidate. And during your program, that's why when you have some uh, are going through some of these topics, place pay special focus on this, right? Now, apart from that, what is also required is you should have inter uh, interest in contemporary approaches to service design, including the uses of containers and container orchestration like Docker, Kubernetes. These are very popular uh, container technologies. Streaming data platforms like Kafka, some of you might have come from a big data platform. It's an advantage. APIs and in-memory NoSQL stores like Redis, NoSQL databases, you have MongoDB. Even if you know any of those NoSQL data databases, I think you should be fine. So essentially what they are expecting is they don't only expect you to know machine learning inside out, but they are wanting you to have technical chops. Also, you need to be from a technical background. And if you're from a technical background, I think this role is something that you would excel at and you'd you, pretty well, right? Apart from that, they, they have mentioned the standard things that are mentioned in most data science roles. You are able to communicate with non-technical colleagues about technical matters and you're comfortable putting yourself in other people's shoes and you are happy and excited to explore new programming languages, techniques, and technologies. In fact, the whole reason right now you are in the program is because you are excited about learning new languages and technologies. And I think this is something that you would enjoy about this role as well. Overall, all in all, very well-written role. Someone who has good understanding of 
machine learning algorithm, data science techniques, plus who can deploy all of this in production should apply for this role. And uh, this is a company which would put you in very good direction in terms of putting your career on the right track, uh, MasterCard data science role, scientist role we are analyzing uh, so far. And one of the key takeaways I have for, for you from this role is that as you learn, go through the programs that you're going through, GCD, GCDI, etc. Some of the things that you keep on doing, right, as I mentioned during this description also, do not just skip over those things and go fast. Spend good amount of time in some of these basics like Pandas, Scikit-learn, NumPy, because you were expected to know these things in most of the interviews that you'll be going for. So I hope you like, like this analysis of Data Star. Let me know if you did. This was Data Scientist Mastercard role at Gurga. I'll be back with another episode of Data Star very soon. Till then, take care. Thank you.